Hi everyone, my name is LB Hun, and today I'm bringing you my rendition of the Land Crab Fam. On the left is me. Uh, I actually streamed this on Twitch earlier today, actually. Uh, I'm doing this all in one day. <laughs> but I stream this on Twitch. You can catch me there every day at 7pm CST, except for Wednesdays. Those are my off days. But uh, let's get into this family, because there's a lot. So this family consists of Nancy, her husband, uh, Joffrey, their two kids, Johnny and Malcolm, let me grab my notes, and then Malcolm is married to his wife, Hanalur, with their three children, Adrian, Mimi, and Dudley. Uh, also, I gave Nancy her parents, but uh, I didn't put them in here. You can see them down on the bottom. They're the two on the right. I didn't record them. I did, but they're not in this recording just because I actually uh, maybe kind of sort of killed them off. <laughs> I made them just to exist in the family tree, but they are deceased. R.I.P. But uh, yeah, so everyone here is revamped, recuted, <laughs> recuted, you know, enhanced, cutened up, that kind of thing, and I have a tiny story for them. Uh, not so much a, a story that affects their background or anything, it's just that I gave a theme to all of them. Uh, Queenie in all of her outfits, or most of her outfits, is wearing like a silver bracelet, which she passes that down to Nancy, who is also wearing a silver bracelet. And then Chester is wearing a gold watch, who passes that gold watch down to Malcolm, who is then wearing a gold watch a bunch. Uh, Joffrey, he's not an actual land grab. He marries into the family, so I gave him a brown watch, which he passes down to Johnny. And then all of the kids are super young, so they don't have any kind of jewelry or like watches like that, so... But I thought that was really cool. I thought that made them unique to me, and I thought I would share that to you guys. Because uh, I uploaded these guys on the uh, the gallery, but I didn't put, you know, that little tidbit of information. I just said that this was my, you know, rendition of the light grabs. But, yes, uh, they are all ambitious, snobby, and materialistic. Uh, I think a few of them are good, a few of them are, you know, artistic, you know. But for the most part, every single one of them is ambitious and snobby. It's crazy. I cannot wait to never have to make another snobby sim again. Um, I feel like I've made uh, 19 snobby sims back to back to back, which I think I only made nine. I made quite a few land grabs, but yes, this is them. Uh, a little bit of story. Johnny is a disowned land grab, so I just assumed, I mean, that's what it says in his Sims 4 description, so I just assumed that his parents were um, Nancy and uh, Joffrey. I don't actually have any confirmation of that. I couldn't really, the family trees that I was finding were fan-made, and I couldn't find a whole lot of uh, family trees where he's actually included, but... I included him for fun. Uh, he is a comedian. I vamped up his style. He looks pretty cool. I don't know if I showed him off too much uh, in this because I think I was focusing more on Malcolm, his wife, and their kids. But Malcolm is a cutie. I made him an adult or a young adult. I think a young adult, if I'm correct. And he is a politician. Uh, I found a Malcolm who existed in The Sims 3, who had a wife named Hanulur, and they had one kid named Adrian, and so I just kind of meshed the two Malcolms together. I don't know if they're the same Malcolm, I'm not real sure. They exist, they both exist in The Sims 3, so I don't think they're the same Malcolm, but I made them the same Malcolm. And then uh, in The Sims 1, there was a, another Malcolm Landgrab, and he was married to a woman named Mom Landgrab. Yes, you heard that right. A woman named Mom Langrab. And they had two kids, uh, Mimi and Dudley. I couldn't find a whole lot of information on them either, uh, other than the fact that they knew how to cook. So I kind of just made up my own assumptions with those two. But 
I also meshed in that Malcolm into this Malcolm. And so this is the condensed line grab family, in my opinion, in my, you know, my little LB Hun universe. <laughs> so yes, uh, right now you're watching Hanalur. That is a German name. I don't know if I'm saying it right. My apologies if I'm not, but she is a businesswoman. She is classy and badass. I think she looks really hot. Uh, her husband, Malcolm, is also pretty attractive too. I think I really made the land grab uh, genetics work. As you can tell, I don't spend too much time like messing with their faces. I just kind of tweak a few things here and there and then kind of go because I think they're all attractive sims. They just, you know, need some help in a few departments and I gave that to them. But yes, I, I gave her very business savvy kind of outfits. I don't know. I don't know if you call them business savvy, but you know, I think they look, they look nice. They fit her very well. And then for the kids, uh, I was going to make Adrian a teen, but I just really didn't want to make another, another Sim and have to make outfits for them. Ugh. So I made it, I made him a kid. It. Oh my goodness. Calling my Sims it. <laughs> I made him a child. And uh, I put his trait or his like goal as creative and he has a creative trait because the Adrian I found was a creative person. Uh, he wanted to play guitar, I believe. I, I don't remember correctly, but this is him. He's about to turn into a kid. He's about to turn into a kid. Oh my goodness. Uh, pretty new to this whole YouTube thing, so trying to get into it, get into the swing of things. But yes, this is Adrian. Then there's Mimi. She is a little blonde, pigtailed little girl. She's very cute. Uh, her past life, <laughs> the one in Sims 1, was a wild party animal, so I gave the toddler the wild uh, trait. And then for Dudley, um, he was also kind of a party animal, but a little more like of a hippie kind of party animal, who also, both of them knew how to cook. That, that's it. So... <laughs> I just kind of made him laid back. Oh no, I hit my hand. I'm sorry. Uh, he's just laid back, chill. You know, you can't really put that they cook. Uh, I gave him the charmer treat. I thought that was kind of fitting. I could totally see it. But we are nearing the end of the video. I very much appreciate you watching. Thank you for watching to this end. I know that this video is rough. I am trying my hand at making YouTube videos. I am super happy and super excited to, to do this. So please, uh, I hope you have a good day. Uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking around. And again, I stream on Twitch every day, except for Wednesdays at 7 p.m. CST. You can catch me over there. Same username, LB Hun. Uh, links are in the description to all of my social medias. And I will see you guys Next time. Thank you.